Hi, I'm Megan. I'm a first grade teacher in Adelaide, Australia. I'd like to give you a quick overview of how to use Maker's Empire and tell you why, as a teacher, I love it. The first thing you need to know is that Maker's Empire is split into two products, Maker's Empire 3D, the world's most fun and easy to use 3D design app that your students will use to make their designs, and Maker's Empire Teacher Dashboard, which you will use to set up your classes and to quickly assign, manage and assess your students' work. Let's take a look at some of the main features of the Maker's Empire 3D app. Maker's Empire 3D is the only 3D design app built specifically for primary school students. The interface is very kid friendly and it looks like a game, but don't be fooled, there is some serious learning going on. The Maker's Empire 3D interface is centred around a town centre called Maker World. Students have an avatar that is a 3D character of themselves, which walks around Maker World. From Maker World, your students will be able to access a bunch of different areas and activities, but first they must visit the training lab to complete a series of guided tutorials to learn the basic tools and skills required to start making 3D designs. Once they've completed their basic training, the rest of Maker World is unlocked and they can visit the other areas. Challenge Central is where they complete curriculum aligned challenge courses based on different themes like Mission to Mars. Challenge Central is designed with a project-based learning approach. Students watch educational videos, complete fun quizzes, learn new skills with pro training tutorials, and then respond to design challenges. You can choose which challenge course your students see and assess their work, but more on that later. Mission Maker is where students can find quick design missions to try. Design missions are shorter activities that can usually be completed in one lesson or assigned for homework. You can assign your own design missions via the teacher dashboard or assign one of over 100 pre-made missions from the Maker's Empire team to suit your learning objectives and areas of interest. Maze Mania is super popular with students. Here, they can design their own 3D maze games to share with other students. Making and solving 3D mazes is a great way to improve their spatial abilities, test physical constraints and practice predicting outcomes. Plus, it is really, really fun. Students can always go to the Create tab anytime to simply design anything they can imagine. Maker's Empire's design tools called Shaper and Blocker are designed with young learners in mind and are far more intuitive than any other design software on the market. It's easy to get started and with a bit of practice and perseverance, students can create amazing designs. Students' work is saved in My Designs. They can go here anytime if they want to edit or copy their designs. Finished designs can also be displayed in the gallery. Students can browse the gallery for inspiration, buy copies of their favorite designs with the tokens they've earned and leave feedback for their fellow designers. It's important to note that students have the choice to keep their work private if they wish, and teachers can control the size of the audience their students interact with, anything between all Maker's Empire users worldwide down to just your class. So that's a very quick overview of the Maker's Empire 3D app. Let's have a look at the teacher dashboard. To navigate the teacher's dashboard, use the menu on the left. New teachers can follow the Getting Started section for help setting up their class lists and tips for running their first class. It can take as little as 15 minutes to get everything set up and if you have any trouble you can contact Maker's Empire via the help button. One of the most important sections of the teacher dashboard for any teacher is of course class management. Here you can find your class lists and all your students. You can quickly take care of all your basic admin like adding, moving and archiving students and control what content your students access in Maker World. Teachers can also award tokens anytime to reward good work and good behaviour. Use your power wisely! As I briefly mentioned during the app overview, you can choose a challenge course for your students to complete. Each challenge course is curriculum aligned and addresses key design and technologies, also called engineering design, learning outcomes. 
You can monitor and assess your students' progress through the challenge courses using the challenge report tool. This tool makes it really easy to see which students are excelling and which need more support and makes assessment super easy. You can also quickly find anything your students have created using the view and assess tool. The filters make it easy to find exactly what you're looking for. Click on the design to take a closer look and leave feedback for your student. Or you can assess design missions, download designs, delete work and even order 3D prints with just a few clicks. In my experience, Maker's Empire has been a great way to engage my students and challenge their creative problem solving. The kids really love it and it's made it super easy for me to cover the design and technologies curriculum. I reckon the best way to learn is to just have a go. You'll quickly get the hang of it, but if you do ever get stuck, you can search the help articles or get in touch with the friendly Maker's Empire team. Good luck. Bye.